Hey friends, this is my uh, video about the squat challenge that I've been doing for the last month or so. Uh, today's the last day of the squat challenge. I've um, been doing it for the last 30 days, squatting for a total of 30 minutes every day. Um, this challenge was made by Ido Portal and I heard about it, I don't know, uh, maybe five or six years ago and I've wanted to do it since then and uh, have had the intention to do it for a while but haven't really had the opportunity or circumstances to do it and um, yeah the trigger actually for doing it was I downloaded the streaks habit tracker on my phone and started using it and I saw that it had a timer function where you could um, track a certain amount of time for a task or habit each day and I was like oh I should use that for the habit tracker. Um, I should use that function for the squat challenge. So, um, cause typically, you know, um, when I was starting, I could only do it for, I could only squat for say two or three minutes at a time. Um, yeah, but over the month I've seen a lot of changes. Uh, you know, when I first started doing it, could only do two or three minutes max to start. A lot of times it was more like 10, 20, 30 seconds. And then really within a few days, I started seeing those times increase quite significantly. Um, you know, could do five or six minutes at a time, and um, yeah, the first ten days or so were really, really hard, um, especially because um, my legs were just sore all of the time, especially even surprisingly, like, at night, my knees would be really, really sore. Uh, I could, like, feel my legs hurting through the whole night, and it was hard to sleep well at the beginning. Um, but that was also motivating. I don't know, I could see that it was having a significant impact on my legs and my body and that it was worth pushing through and um, yeah, the last like 12 or days or so there hasn't been really significant pain in my legs and then also really big shift is I can squat now for uh, about 25 minutes max. Um, last few days I've done usually 20 or 25 minutes in one go and then the last five, ten minutes in another stretch, um, which is just a huge change. As I say, I could only do two or three minutes a day to start, and uh, it's just a lot easier to squat. Um, I think um, the other thing that I've really noticed is that uh, I have some damage in this leg, in my knee, and my ankle, and I don't know, the phenomenology, first-person experience of injuries is really interesting. It's tricky to describe, but it still feels like those injuries are there, but I think that doing this challenge really helps, especially my ankle to heal. To some extent, I can still feel the injuries there sometimes, but there's just a lot less pain. It feels a lot more normal, um, and it seems like the squatting really helped with that a lot. So absolutely really excited about that. Didn't expect that to happen, but really grateful for it. Um, it's caused me some pain and suffering over the years that I've had that injury and I'm just happy that it's healing and that this challenge seemed to help with it. Um, yeah, trying to think what else. Yeah, I just really enjoyed it. I would often be on this porch or outside somewhere and would get me outside and get a lot of sunlight and move my body and uh, it would give a break to my day where I wasn't just sitting at a computer all day but would be out and about doing things and really enjoyed that aspect of the challenge. Um, yeah, and it feels like a resting squat now. I just feel totally comfortable in this position. Um, I found myself moving into this position a lot more for like daily tasks. Like if I needed to look for something in a cupboard or a closet, I would just get into a squat if it was on the floor and that would feel totally comfortable. And before I think I was sort of subconsciously avoiding the squatting position because it was uncomfortable and I couldn't stay in it for a long time, but it's just so much more comfortable and familiar now even within the 30 days and that's been such a huge change um yeah uh so i'm really excited about it i'm super proud of myself for doing this challenge i wanted to do it for a long time and finally did it i'm planning on starting ido portal's other main challenge which is the hang challenge where you hang for seven minutes a day total split up into as many chunks as you need um starting uh, tomorrow or soon uh, so we'll see how that goes but if it's anything like this challenge I'm expecting a lot of significant changes during that time um, right now um, when I test it I can only hang for like 5 10 20 30 seconds and if it got easier to hang on a pull-up bar or something like that uh, that would be 
tremendous because I think, um, you know, with pull-ups right now, my grip is really the constraint and I can probably lift myself more with my muscles than my grip in my hands allows. So uh, I imagine that doing that challenge will have some similar significant benefits. I'm uh, really excited about that. So um, it's been super motivating to me to do this challenge. I had a lot of fun with it. It was only 30 days and saw really significant benefits and um, just totally enjoyed doing it as well. So would highly recommend it. And if this is your jam and uh, yeah, I'm also really excited about doing the hang challenge soon and happy to be sharing my progress with you. So thanks for watching. And uh, if you try it out, curious to hear how it goes for you.